How do we upload the EPS into Truck Agitator's drum? Let me show you how in just a few minutes. To start with, we use a container as the main feeder, large enough to accommodate at least 6 kilograms per bag of EPS. But first, double-check the weights of each bag of EPS using a calibrated weighing scale. Assign a dedicated member to check and record the weights of each bags, making sure each truck will receive the correct quantity of EPS according to approved mix design. Beside the tank, we make a hole and insert a 3 inches diameter pipe made from a durable materials. Then we connect the other end into a simple suction motor, powerful enough to pump the EPS from the main feeder tank into approximately 6 meter length pipe, in upward position, heading to the truck agitator's chute. Here, we are uploading 8 bags of EPS for each truck agitator. Here, take a closer look how these beautiful EPS beads is being loaded inside this rotating drum of the truck agitator. After loading the EPS beads, the truck will then goes to batching plant to receive the corresponding slurry mixture. I recommend to batch only 6 cubic meters of lightweight concrete per truckload. This will allow more space to mix properly the EPS beads with the slurry mixture inside the rotating drum. Wow, look closely how beautiful and homogeneous this lightweight concrete. Amazing! Now, it's time to test the temperature, slump and fresh density to verify its compliance to fresh concrete properties as per approved mix design. For more concrete learning videos like this, please subscribe to our channel. This is an example of lightweight concrete mix design worksheet, where you can easily start designing your own. Keep on watching to find out what will be the fresh density for this beautiful lightweight concrete. The consistency is just right, using lowest possible pressure, we use our normal mobile pump to convey this onto the rooftop. Wow, notice how the EPS beads are being coated with just right amount of paste. With the help of right amount of entrained air voids using air entraining it mixture. This is an example of roof slab made of EPS lightweight concrete right after the pour. The mass of concrete sample together with the bucket is 10.19 kilograms. Now, subtract the weight of empty bucket which is 3.94 kilograms from the 10.19 kilograms. Then divide the difference to the volume of the bucket which is 0.007 cubic meter. The result of fresh density in this example was 890 kilograms per cubic meter. Thank you for watching.